In this video, we demonstrate how to check a memory safety property using Atlas. Atlas is a platform for software analysis using graph schema. Let's see an example. Code shown is from Xenu, an embedded operating system. In the function dswrite, a memory is allocated on line 21 using the function getBuff. But a corresponding deallocation using the function freeBuff in Xenu is missing. When an allocated memory is not deallocated, it is a memory safety violation and is called memory leak. Is there a memory leak in Xenu? Static analysis tools perform interprocedural analysis to compute the call chains on screen and find that on some execution paths the memory is deallocated in the function dskq opt, but not on all execution paths. Thus, the tools conclude there is a memory leak in Xenu and recommend to deallocate memory at the end of dswrite. This fix is problematic as it violates the Xenu design which takes care of the issue using interrupts. A correct analysis should also capture a function which is invoked by an interrupt and deallocates the memory. This is a valid implementation of the producer-consumer pattern and there is in fact no memory leak. Let's dive in and find this missing function using Atlas. First step in analyzing software in Atlas is to build a graph representation for the code in Atlas. To do that, first create an Eclipse project for the code. For AC code, such as Xenu, click File, New, Make File Project with Existing Code. Browse to your code location, give it a name, and click Finish. After creating the project, click Atlas, Manage Project Settings, select your project, Xenu in this case. Click Add. Click Save and Remap. This creates a graph representation for the code base in Atlas. You can follow the progress with the progress bar on the bottom right. Now we are ready to analyze Xenu. Analysis in Atlas is done by interacting with the graph representation. Atlas provides a query language to facilitate the interaction and an execution environment to execute the queries. This environment is called Atlas Shell. Click Atlas. Open Atlas Shell to open Atlas Shell. Let's warm up by locating the code we are interested in, the function dswrite. The query for locating dswrite is functions query. Hit enter to execute the query. Using the show query, we can see the result of the executed query. It shows a node in the graph that represents the function dswrite. Atlas maintains source correspondence with the graph. Double-clicking on the graph elements navigates to the code segments represented by the graph elements. The function dswrite allocates a memory of the type dREC. We will make use of this information to discover the missing function necessary to complete the analysis. Let's start by creating some handy variables to represent the allocation function getBuff, the deallocation function freeBuff, and the type dREC. First compute all the functions that can potentially alias the memory allocated in dswrite. Let's see the result of the query. It does capture dswrite as expected, but it also captures dsinter, the function invoked by an interrupt. We are interested in a subset of these functions as not all of them can deallocate the memory. The query to compute the relevant functions and the call chains is a combination of multiple queries. First query computes the relevant call chains originating at dswrite. Second query computes the relevant call chains invoked by an interrupt. Finally, we combine the two results. Here are the call chains computed by the query that are necessary to complete the analysis. It shows that dswrite allocates a memory, which is passed through dsknq to dskq opt and is deallocated on some execution paths in dskq opt.
The other mechanism for deallocation is via deinter, which is invoked by an interrupt. It accesses the memory allocated in DSWrite using a global alias and deallocates it. The verification can then be completed using a model checker to verify all execution paths captured in these call chains. To know more about Atlas, its graph representation, and the query language, visit nsoftcorp.com atlas.